Today we're going to be talking about the Georgia-Florida weekend on St. Simons Island and what has become known as Frat Beach. Uh, this event's been going on for for quite some time. Uh, young people from Athens, Georgia, coming down to St. Simons the weekend of the Georgia-Florida football game and uh, taking advantage of the beach and doing what young people do out on the beach just in a large group. Uh, there's been some concerns, and recently an ordinance was passed for two days to ban alcohol on the St. Simons Beach. And our question was, did this have a deterrent effect on those visitors that come down uh, to Frat Beach, Georgia, Florida weekend? So we've got some points here. We talked with some folks and we wanted to share this with you here for the community of St. Simons Island. Left us in the answer. This is all awesome right here. Hey, Menorke Baby Cat Mandy coming to you and we are on St. Simons right at the beach. It is the annual Georgia, Florida get together uh, and we got some dogs here. Ooh, ooh. Guys, yes, just real quick, where are you from? I'm from Marietta, Georgia. From Marietta as well. Athens, Georgia. Marietta. Atlanta. Marietta. All right. North Georgia, guys. And I think yeah. somebody was from Jacksonville somewhere along, yeah, along the line. Yeah. But anyhow, so you guys have come down. Is this your first first trip to St. Second. Second. No, second, second. trip. Second. Okay. Yeah. Um, now, part of the deal, and this, we've been kind of following this in our community. Uh, they they passed an ordinance not, not wanting alcohol out on the beach. And, and folks can come down and enjoy the beach the way they choose to. Um, did that give y'all any pause on your trip coming down uh, to, to the beach for, 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 for what, not, what, for what like, we've come to know is Frat Beach? No, sir. No, no sir. sir. Now we got to support the dogs. Dog not, was, not at all, sir. We had a good raft this time the first time we came down, so we're trying to roll it back this year, if and you know what said, I'm saying. My thought process was, look, if they're – if they're if they're banning if they're banning drugs on the beach, like we'll throw it away when we get there. But there was no like pause to be like, oh, we shouldn't come down yeah. here for that. Like, we're, we also we're won't throw it away when we get there. We're here to have a good time. Um, alcohol is not like what's forcing us to come here or like bringing us here. Uh, the it's whole the campus dogs. comes down. We got the weekend off. We're heading to Jacksonville tomorrow, so that's a lot more important to us than whether or not we can consume alcohol or not on the beach. So the most important thing, the most important thing this weekend is that the dogs cover. Right. Dogs, 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 dogs cover. Dogs cover. If you don't know yet by now, the dogs are in, in, in the contest we know as football here in the United States. They are currently ranked number one. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Easily. In the United States. <laughs> That's Easily. right. We're, we're awfully excited about that. And, uh, hey, only thing I got to say to you guys is go dogs. Go, go dogs. dogs. I want y'all to be safe out there. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. <laughs> now, you guys, this is this is your first time yes. here on St. Simon. Yes, yes. that is correct. Coming down from Frat Beach. Yes. yes, correct. Now, where are you guys from? Athens. Athens. You grew up in Athens? No, no. we're from right, Atlanta. Hold on, hold on. At your hometown, the Atlanta. closest post office, what's the name on that building? I couldn't tell you. You don't know no. where you're from. Next. I'm from Suwannee. Oh, Suwannee. oh Dunwoody. The Atlanta area. Atlanta area. Dunwoody. Dunwoody. All yes. Right. North Georgia again. Close yeah, to, North Georgia. Here again from North Georgia. First time here. Now, um, you, I'm assuming you guys are freshmen at the University yes. of Georgia. Yeah, yeah. So you're down here having a great time. <laughs> yeah. Your impressions so far? <laughs> it's been really, really pretty. Fun. Really Very pretty. Fun. Have y'all made it out to the beach? No, oh, not yet. Okay. But I've been here before, like for family vacations. All right. There was, there's a, uh, I don't know. You guys may or may not be aware, but there was a, a no alcohol ordinance yeah, yeah. for, for the past couple of days. 
just for this event. Yeah. yeah. Just mm -hmm. for you guys. Yeah. yeah. Did that have any bearing on your decision to come down to St. We were a worried bit. a bit. I mean, we, we, I just we almost didn't come. Clear I th yeah, I think a lot of people just decided not to come because of it, but then we were just like, eh, I mean, like, it'll be fun either way. Like, yeah. Yeah. people will have fun. Pretty I think. much is what you guys make of it. Yeah. yeah. We had yeah. planned this make trip like two days ago. Yeah. <laughs> but, oh, yeah. Kind of a spur of the moment. Yeah. 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 Because we weren't sure how many people were actually going to go, but yeah. a, a lot of people ended up coming still. Oh, yeah. So. Now, we want to. You guys look awesome, but I, I got to remind some of my viewers that it is Halloween weekend. Yeah, yeah that's true. So you guys are, are in for the festivities of yeah. Halloween. Yes. Oh, yeah. And it's, that's why we're seeing a lot of a lot of folks that are coming down. And we got costumes. Look, look yeah. At these, look at these a lot guys of costumes. Yeah. Those are terrible costumes. Half yeah, of them aren't are, even dressed up. I know. I saw the that alcohol one. That we got was one, bad. We got one guy from the beach service. We got uh, a breath. Hey, here. come here. Come here, come here. We're, good, we're, doing we're getting so interviewed. We're getting interviewed right now. I gotta get this guy. This guy right here, right over here. Uh, right over here. Come into the interview. This is like my actual job. Yeah. That's you work, you work uh, for Bears? Yes, sir. All right, come stand right over here. Give, give me some good light. Back up a little bit right there. <laughs> oh, wait. So we can. Where's guys, this, where's I, this I, going on? I, uh, YouTube. It is on my YouTube okay. channel. That's my mom. <laughs> Your mom may. She may be a subscriber. Oh, um, that's all. <laughs> That's a great thing. So, on Facebook. Um, you're from here. It's not really that worried. Yeah, I, I am worried about you. Where are you from? Here. You're, you guys, all right, the ordinance that was passed, I'm sure you guys are aware of it mm. uh, because that's been, oh. been kind of a big thing. Okay, do I press um, a button? When, uh, the, has that had any kind of bearing on, obviously not on you guys coming <laughs> down here, but did it, did it change your mind about coming to the beach? Well, the answer to that question is like they could put a bunch of orders as much as they want to, but it's not gonna like really change anything because people are still gonna do what they want to do either way. I'm not saying that. Well, let me change my thing so, so I don't incriminate myself. But it's just that like it really depends because after living, I've lived here for four years, so it's not really that uh, people still they find always find a way. That's sure, the main sure. thing. And that's, that's just, that's the resourceful nature of the youth yep. of this yes, great sir. country. All right. Yes, sir. Guys, God bless America. Go dogs. I want you to go dogs all the way. Hey, I want all you guys to be safe today, okay? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. All right. All right. Thank you. Take care. Thank you. All right. Have a good one. All right, let me ask you, Coach Joe. You've been out riding a bike today. Yes, sir. How many how many kids we got on the island for Georgia, Florida? Ooh, it's hard to tell because they're all spread out. I, I would say at least five thousand. Yeah. Minimum. Yeah. Have you seen any problems since you've been out? Uh, the... I haven't seen any. Yeah, the kids are out having a good time. Yeah. Um. Y'all y'all were out on the beach for a while today. Yes, sir. How were things How were things down there? It was pretty fun. It was yeah. Good, good turnout. Good turnout. Now. Did, did you guys hear about this ordinance that, that was enacted just for the couple days, no alcohol on the beach? Did you, are you guys, now where, where, where are you guys from? We're, I'm from Fairburn, she's from Petrie City. Okay, North Georgia, and uh, I'm assuming your dogs, y'all up yes, from sir, the University absolutely. of Georgia. Did, uh, did, did that ordinance, did it have any bearing on whether or not you guys were gonna plan a trip to St. Simons to come down for Georgia, Florida weekend? So I think the, the ordinance was a good idea because I do think it like, reduce the amount of waste on the beach like i don't think as many people carry beer stuff. cans and yes, stuff so like that absolutely but i do think most people decided like hey we're probably drink beforehand and go hang out on the beach so. that's an interesting part and i hadn't even thought about that yeah. what you just said so the amount reduce waste the amount yeah. of debris that you we absolutely. usually see out so there I, I think it was effective in that regard that like I mean, you don't want trash in the ocean. No, and, right? and that's yeah. that's that's people have commented that's been a problem in the past, Absolutely. and that's a great point. Yeah, that's a great point. Hey, so I think we're reduced on that. Yeah. You guys have a great day and Thank be safe. Sir. Okay. Go All right, go dogs. go dogs. And this this is a volunteer group that comes out, and this is part of what they do. Um, it, it's not only uh, for this event, but it's, it's kind of it's a continuous thing. They'll have cleanups uh, along some of our marshes, uh, some of our uh, beaches. Some of our roadways, um, pretty much anything and everything. We have a, an event called March Madness in the spring, and we pick, pick up a lot of trash around the marshes, uh, not just on St. Simons, but 
in Glen County and West Glen County. Right. And we even have people from McIntosh. It's, 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 it's keep, keep Golden Isles beautiful. You guys, yes, yes. You, we want the whole area to look nice. Yes. Whether it's visitors or residents of the area, you want, want everybody to have a nice place. Yes. And part of that is being responsible. I agree, being responsible with the, with our trash and how we manage it. Right. This, was this your first time? Yeah, first, first time. First now. time? All right. What did y'all think about the, the gathering that was going on down here? There's a lot of people. A lot of people down there. People. Everybody having a good time? Yeah. Yeah. Everyone's having yeah. a good time. Yeah. The police is doing a good job of regulating everyone. Yeah, some, some people having a little bit too much of a good time. Well, you know, uh, that's that's happened from time to time. We, we, we've seen that. Um, any trouble or anything like that you guys saw while you were out there? I didn't see Great. Where are you guys from? Tell me real quick. Georgia. Where? Canton, Georgia. Canton? Canton, Georgia. Augusta, Georgia. Augusta, Georgia. Augusta, Augusta Georgia. Well, hey, I want you guys to be safe out there and, and uh, y'all enjoy the rest of the day. Go dogs. All right? Sure, all right. Go Take dogs, care. Go dogs. You've been down on the beach here today at Frat Beach. Yes. Uh, kind of looked around and, and, and saw saw what's going on. Your impressions of what, what uh, are the activities going on down at the beach today? I think that uh, it's a bunch of kids just having fun right now. Yeah. Uh, you know, there are a few that uh, look like they've not been out there been out there before. Right. Rookies. Right. And uh, they probably have had a little too much to drink, but I well, think that's the minority of what I, I've seen. I think we have, we've seen that in any time you get, there must be uh, 8,000 kids down there. And I don't care if you're having a, an arts festival or, or a, a, a football contest. Right. Um, things are going to happen. Right. And, uh, but the kids, let me ask you this. The, the, we've had, the, I had one, one youngster that came up here and had some insight. I asked him about the ordinance that's in place about right. alcohol. And he said, let me tell you what I've noticed. He's been here his second year coming to this thing. Is not as much trash on the beach this year I agree. because they're not taking suitcases of beer there. Exactly. They've got they've got their their beverages are in containers right. and they're taking them down and bringing them back off. Is that what you noticed down there? I noticed that, and I noticed that uh, the first responders that are down there uh, they're working with the kids, and uh, if they need help, they're getting them somewhere where they can get hydrated and uh, that sort of thing. So I, it it looks like everybody's working well together. That is outstanding. Well, I certainly appreciate your time. Okay. You go on, enjoy the day. Be safe out there and go dogs. Go dogs. Hey, Menorca Navy, thanks for being with us today as we kind of explored uh, one of the issues on St. Simon surrounding the Georgia-Florida football weekend. Um, again, it's one of those things that I thought you guys might find interesting. Hey, uh, we're going to ask if you haven't done it yet, click on that subscribe link, give us some thumbs up, share the video, keep the comments coming, and most of all, we want you guys to stay safe out there.